Hello grade 8 students, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Angelito Panuncio. In this lesson, you will learn how to factor completely polynomials that are factors of difference of two squares. So there are two important things to remember in factoring difference of two square. First, get the principal square root of the two square. Second, using these square roots form two factors, a sum and difference. Okay, difference of two square. From the word difference, it is minus sign. 2 square, we have 2 perfect square term. Or it is important to know what is a perfect square number. Okay, so what are the perfect square numbers? So we have 1 square is equal to 1, 2 square is equal to 4, 3 square is equal to 9, 4 square is equal to 16. 5 square is equal to 25 and so on. So napakalagang malaman natin kung ano nga bang mga perfect square numbers para mas mapabilis ang ating pag-aaral sa difference of 2 square. Now let us proceed to the form of difference of 2 square. So ganito lang yan. Form of difference of 2 square. So, we have 2 square and the operation we use is subtraction. So, let us illustrate this. <coughs> Let's say our first term is x square. So, meron na tayong 1 square. And another term is y square. So, meron na tayong 2 square. The x square and the y square. Next, sabi, difference, so maglalagay tayo ng subtraction between the two terms. So ito na yung tinatawag na difference of 2 square. Now, let us proceed to factors of difference of 2 square. So ano nga ba magiging factor ng x square less y square? So magiging factor lang nito. Get the square root of each term. And in first term natin, we have x squared. So, kukunin lang natin ang square root ng ating first term. And the square root ng ating first term, we have x. x multiplied by x, we have x squared. Next, square root of second term. Yeah. Our second term is y squared. So, in po, y square, square root of y square is equal to y. Then, next na gagawin, magperform lang tayo ng sum and difference. Okay? So, yan. Sum and difference. You see, the square root of our first term and the square root of the second term. Talagay natin dito, our first term, square root of the second term. Square root of the first term, square root of the second term. So, ito na yung magiging factors ng difference of the square natin. So, madali lang. So, let's have another example. Let's say our example is x squared less 36. Okay, bago muna natin i-factor ng ganito, check muna natin kapag ito ba ay difference of 2 squared. Ang x squared ay perfect square ba? Okay, yes. x multiply by x. How about naman yung 36? Yes. 6 multiply by 6. So, ibig sabihin, ito po ay difference of 2 square. So, kunin muna natin yung square root ng ating first term. So, x 
squared. Ano yung square root ng ating first term na x squared is equal to x. Next, square root ng ating second term which is equal to 36. So we have 6. Next, using x and 6, we will form sum and difference. Okay? So sum and difference. So, gawin natin, square root ng first term, x, then x din dito. Square root ng second term, 6, then 16 dito. So, ito na po yung magiging sagot natin sa x square less 36. Sundan? Uh, let's have another example. Let's say... 16x squared less 25y squared. So, i-check natin kapag difference of the square nga ba ito? 16, is it perfect square? Yes. 4 multiplied by 4. x squared? Yes. x multiplied by x. 25. Yes. 5 multiplied by 5. Y square? Yes. Y multiplied by Y. So, tama. Difference of the square siya. Difference naman ang gamit dito. So, first step, get the square root of its term. So, our first term is 16x squared. Ano nga ba ang magiging square root niyan? It is equal to 4x. Next, square root of the second term. So, we have 25y squared. Ano nga ba square root niyan? We have 5y. Uh, using 4x and 5y, gawa ulit tayo ng sum and difference. So, magiging sagot, sum, difference. Ano yung first term natin? Square root ng first term? 4x. Ilagay natin dito 4x, then 4x. Next, square root of our second term, 5y. Ilagay natin second term, 5y, then 5y. So, ito na yung magiging sagot natin. Sa difference of 3 square, 16x squared less 25y squared. My last, last example. So, let's say 121m squared less 225m squared. Okay. Pulin natin ang square root ng ating first term. It is equal to 11m square root ng first term. So, ibig sabihin, 11m din sa kabila. Then, isang plus, isang minus, then, yeah, square root ng ating second term. 225, ibig sabihin, we have 15m. Then, 15 and then sa kabila. So, ito na po yung magiging sagot natin. So, that is factors of difference of the square. Ayan! I hope na meron na naman kayong natutunan sa video ito na inyong pinanood. Huwag niyong kakalimutan na kapag difference of two square, ang first term at second term natin ay perfect square. And it is separated by a minus sign. At ang magiging factors ay sum and difference ng square root ng first term and square root ng second terms. So, ayan. We're done! Don't forget to like our video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, comment if you have clarification, and share it to your classmates. See you on my next video!